Hey, I'm Jay from the Cub Scouts. Welcome back to another episode of The Quarry. I'm so happy to be on this journey with you all from start to finish. I'm so excited, in fact, that I actually checked the comments, which is a bad idea for story-based games because I did get spoiled on just one thing, though, just one thing, and I stopped reading the comments. It sucks because I do enjoy reading the comments, but there are spoilers all over the place. So if you don't want to be spoiled in the comment section, don't read it. Just watch the videos, wait for me to upload the next part. And yeah, I got spoiled on one part. I'm not gonna mention what it is until we're at that specific part but we are gonna jump back into the quarry and figure out what to do next if you guys cool with that you down with that everybody get ready and buckle up because here we go but i will say that so, the spoiler uh, wasn't that crazy why didn't you it was just come? like a little tip where have you been like a little piece of months? advice basically we did but let me come. let me shut up one night early let's see what this one-eyed monster has to that say that was our mistake so she has one eye and it looked like her forehead got a little bit bigger I think it was the syringe. Whatever was in there, got some steroids or something. June 25th, Laura. All right, so I think we flashed back to the past a little bit. Yeah, this is right after, cause she's still a two-eyed monster right now. And I think the crystal ball said something about taking some keys. There was also a comment that I saw. Can't remember the name at the top of my head, but. They said something about the crystal ball isn't always positive outcomes. Sometimes they just show you outcomes, and they could be good or bad. So it's up to what I think to follow those choices. But there's that creepy-ass cop. I like that guy because he's so damn creepy. Call out. Nope. Just play dead. Just play dead. Let's do that. I don't want to call out because then he's going to be like, oh, you're awake. All right. Time for more syringe. I am going to jack his keys, though. I will follow that piece of advice in the crystal ball. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Don't let him know your next move. That is scary. Ma'am. This is gonna get a little messy. What is that supposed to mean? The fuck? That better not mean what I think it means. Are you gonna chop my dude up? Probably. So we gotta get out of here. We should have just went to that motel, huh? Oh shit! Wait! Oh, wait, duh, because the boyfriend got bit. So he did the same thing that happened to Nick. Fuck. I thought we could save him. What have you done to Max? Shut up. You can't just... Shut up. Yeah, he really got turned to the Max this with that transformation. One dad joke per I video. Ask. Just you answer. <clears throat> Name. Compliant, Laura Kearney, angry, eat shit. Why would I give somebody my name that, well, I feel like he had good intentions, didn't he? Because he didn't want us to come here. He wanted us to go to the motel. But what if those freaks were at the motel too? Angry, eat shit. I'm just going to be compliant. So he doesn't do anything bad to us. Laura Kearney. Who are you traveling with? And what is your relationship? Max Brindley, he's my boyfriend. He's my man. He's my baby. Where were last night? To Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. You already know this. What have you done with Max? No. I ask, you answer. That's how this works. I'm not saying shit. Compliant, fine. What do you all think about this guy? I mean, I'm just gonna be compliant until it gets too personal or too awkward. Fine. Let's just play it by ear. What do you wanna know? I'm only uh, compliant so he doesn't hurt us. Well, uh, why are we going to hack his quarry last night? Max and I are camp counselors. Oh, bullshit. Counselors aren't due until today. I told you, we drove up and got there early. We figured we'd just. Go to camp. Why didn't you go to the motel like I told you? Because we were like way closer to the camp. And Cause you're creepy as fuck we're broke. too. Mm -hmm. Mm 
North kill? I heard it's better than South death. Annoyed that Sheriff's badge doesn't do a lot. Okay, Sheriff. Yeah, okay, big guy. Okay, Sheriff Hackett. His name's Sheriff Hackett? Wait, Hackett? Like, Chris Oh, shit. Hackett? Don't I never saw that. Subject. He's a Hackett? The cop the is losing his patience, but I've been here, so man. compliant. What the hell? You have no idea what's going on here. Not a goddamn clue. You just stepped in some grade A double prime, go ahead and kill yourself cosmic type shit, young lady. All that and type stuff. your stinks. only option is to buckle the fuck up before. and do what I say. Do you understand? Pleading. Please stop trying to intimidate me. Stop fucking around. Let's just be nice again. Please. Be nice. Even though we don't trust this guy, just be nice. Stop trying to intimidate me and tell me what the fuck is going on. Just doing my best here, everybody. Is, is Max alive? I feel like I'm going crazy. What? He has that permanent look, like he's just like... Like he's trying to smell his upper lip. He's like... Lash out? Nah, I'm good. Wait, we can take his keys, right? That might be a bad outcome. So I'm not gonna do it. Let's go. Remember in the crystal ball? I think we could have smacked him. Oh, there hey. he is! Wait! Hey! You what the heck? Asshole! What the, what the fuck's going on? I thought that was Max. Good thing I didn't lash out. Holy shit. I'm out here making the right moves. I'm the man. Fuck. I'm really that dude. Concerned. Are you okay? Dismissive. Screaming isn't going to help. You okay, baby? Max. Are you okay? Yeah. Wait, I mean, what was that red explosion in the cell I'm that you're in? kind of all in? mixed up, but more or less intact, I think. I don't understand. Laura? Yeah? Why am I naked? <laughs> you tell me. What? I mean, after we got attacked... You're not that naked. You have some undies on. The next on. thing I know, I'm waking up in a jail cell, and you're gone, and now you're back again, and, and, and I'm super naked, and there's blood. That's and not super naked. That's just stuff naked. everywhere. Super naked is without the undies. I mean, what the fuck happened? Disappointed. I was hoping you might know. Suspicious. He wanted me to confess. Yeah, so our host was very keen on getting me to confess, but I honestly couldn't tell you what I was meant to be owning up to. Jesus. What he used to try to get you to talk? The pincher? The blade? Three-hole punch? No, it, he wasn't torturing me. Who does this guy think he is? Well, Sheriff of North Kill, apparently. North Kill? Yeah. Max! What? Did you even look at the map? Hackett's Quarry in North Kill. That's the town. Oh. And it gets better. I gotta look at his name badge and... Get dressed. What's he giving you? Not gonna be the guest of honor at Fashion Week, I'll tell you that much. Hey! Yeah. Did I say you could talk to each other? What are you, our dad? Don't need your permission. Sorry, sir. You know what? Fuck this guy! I wasn't aware we needed your permission, Detective Dick Whippet. <laughs> yeah, it's a free country, Officer Oat. For brains. Shit. Well, I mean, if your comebacks are going to be that weak, I should have just said sorry. Had to be sarcastic one time. All right, buddy. Hands through the bars. Come on. Don't do it. Don't do it, Max. <laughs> I'm telling you, that look is just like... <laughs> I love that look. Your turn. <laughs> Let's go. I'm not going anywhere. We can talk right here. Come on. 
Hey, hey! Let's get the fuck off! Come on! Move. Okay, I definitely don't trust this guy now. I mean, Good I didn't boy. trust him before, but I was trying to be compliant. But now, next chance we get, we're kicking him in the hey. balls. Stop struggling. Worried. Leave him alone. Calm down, Max. Uh, Stern? Max, calm down. You're only making it worse. Laura. I'm gonna save you anyway. Don't what worry. Do Watch now? this. Shut up. Watch this, everybody. Okay. Let's go. Okay. Think, Laura, think. There's gotta be something in here you can use. Yeah, watch this, everybody. This is the J way. Hmm. Sis. Oh, loose brick. Why is there always a loose brick in a jail cell? Not a chance. I need some sort of lever. Lever? You need a lever. All right. I got you. Watch me. There's going to be one underneath the pillow. Like some tooth fairy type shit. That's convenient. That could work. That's a little too convenient. Oh, no. That's a spoon. Oh, yeah. This ought to do it. Now what? That ain't shit. Now that we have this hole, what does it all mean? Unless the brick is a weapon. Watch it, man. I bruise easily. <laughs> Give me a break. The second we get out of here, you're toast, motherfucker. Sure. The second you get out. We'll answer your questions. What's that supposed to mean? What the fuck is that supposed to mean? Hey. All right, we're getting out of here. What the fuck I'm is punching that him in the face. Mean, asshole? Yeah. I was trying to be hey, compliant as possible, hey! but it's just not working. It's not working. Come it's backfiring. Back. Fuck! Son of a binky bonky. What are we, family friendly here? Calm down. This is not a family friendly channel. Are you okay? How'd it go? Yeah, be playful. He's our boyfriend at the end of the there? day, right? You sing like a canary? Nothing to sing about. I'm sure you've got plenty to confess. <laughs> well, that may be true, but I don't think he's too interested in how I cheated off Mikey Washington in 8th grade chem. Really, though? What happened? He, uh... He just asked a lot of questions. Like? A lot of weirdly specific questions about us and where we were going and why and how I was feeling this morning and... I don't know. Nothing I said made him seem any less annoyed. He asked how you were feeling? Yeah. Why, he didn't ask you? No. Huh. Rude. I know, he said, fuck your feelings. What was the point of taking that brick out of the wall? Laura, talk to me, please. Max? Anybody? All right. Oh, hey, did you get a look at his name badge? You mean it's not really Detective Dick Whip it? <laughs> it's Hackett. That's his middle name. Sheriff Hackett. You think he's related to Chris Hackett? Oh, my God, like the Chris Hackett? Yeah. Who's the Chris Hackett? <laughs> That's As what I would say, too. camp leader, Mr. Hackett of Hackett's Quarry, remember? Man. Last night feels like a lifetime ago. The fuck does that mean, though? You know? Where we set up? Maybe it's some kind of crazy camp counselor kidnapping ring. That's... I mean... What? 
Max is exactly how I would act in this situation, I think. Suspicious. Some kind of setup. He's not acting like a kidnapper. No, it's definitely sus. Like some kind of setup. A, a, a trap. I don't know. Chris Hackett and Sheriff Hackett? There's no way that's a coincidence. There's no okay. way. They must be related. Well, they have to be. What does that prove? They knew we were coming. It's a pretty weird reveal, too. Maybe it's... That he's a Hackett. Some kind of kidnapping, extortion, conspiracy. That's a pretty big job. But you know what? I don't think I'm that they're trying, trying to get the get counselors killed, I'm just trying to get us out of here, though. and I can't get us out of here until I have some clue of why the fuck we're in here. Because Chris Hackett wanted know. all well, the kids to leave. Sense of it. it was Jacob's fault that well, all the kids to. are there. And their fault that they Sometimes came a day early. Sometimes things just don't make sense. What then? We're just stuck in a backwater jail cell for the rest of our lives? This isn't forever. Lighten up. Let's just be optimistic. This isn't forever, Max. You, you can't just hold us here forever. Just break you didn't out, seem please. Too convinced of that. You gotta stay positive. You can't think like that. Why not? Might as well just accept it, right? No, fuck that. Think about the rest of the summer, Max. And school? I mean, I've been dreaming about becoming a vet since I was five years old. I'm not gonna let this fleabag fuckface stop me. <laughs> fleabag fuckface? I'm using that. We're gonna get out of here. I'm gonna study to be a vet, and you're... gonna, um... Work at Starbucks what? as a barista? I'm gonna what? I saw the letter, Max. What are you talking about? The rejection letter for college. I found it in your bag. You were poking around in my stuff? I can't believe you didn't tell me. I, I was embarrassed. Wait, your grades were good and you wrote a great essay? Yeah, apparently not good enough. You know, I will say, though, some of the smartest people I know didn't even go to fuck. college. So you don't need You've been making plans, college Max, to prove that you're fuck? super smart. I don't smart. know. What do you want me to say? It's all in here. It's not about the paper that told you where you go. I'm sorry, Max. Maybe sorry I lied to you. Let's be empathetic. Care about his feelings. I'm sorry, Max. This don't make it all about you. This really sucks. Hey, it's not the worst thing to happen this summer. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have kept it from you. You know you can talk to me about anything, right? Yeah. Yeah, I do. Max appreciates your sympathy. Love that. We have to figure out a yeah, way out of here, please. Let's just focus on getting out of here for now. Yes, Great. thank you. Sign me up. Let's get we the need ball to go rolling. Over it from the beginning. Like from when we left home. Like from when we ran into the cop. So after we ran into the. Whatever we ran into. Yeah. Actually, yeah, that's when shit started getting weird. The dude acted super weird when we said we almost hit an animal. You remember that? It was like he already knew or something. Yeah. Yeah, that was really sketchy. Yeah, so the Hackett's know what's happening around what here. What if he's not even a real cop? Well, he's got to be dirty, but... I mean, I think he's a real cop. We're in a police station. I mean, yeah, but there's like... Nobody else around. He could have killed the real cops, took over this jail cell. Yeah, that is concerning. Especially the whole Hackett Hackett thing. Let's just go with the idea that they're both in on it. Okay. So we're supposed to meet Chris Hackett at the camp, and instead... There's nobody there, and we get attacked by something, and then the cop shows up. That part's all fuzzy for me. Like, I remember the steps and a smell like wet fur and a... Wet fur? A dog collar with the name Ian on it. Ian? Ian. That's true. I forgot about the dog collar. I don't think it was a dog that attacked us. Whatever it was was big. Like, person-sized big. Yeah, it really did a number on you. Like, I'm surprised you're not more messed up. Like, like, like I vividly remember the thing's teeth ripping into you. Yeah, same. Why does he look what fine? What is messed up about that is... Laura, I don't have a scratch on me. Yeah, that's actually pretty freaking what? weird. 
Hey, okay, so weird question. Do you remember before we got lost? You got I was lost. wondering why he looked like perfectly well, yeah, fine. But before that, I was all like, whoa, look at the moon. It's so big, so cool to see a full moon in the middle of the woods. And you were all like, yeah, no shit, Max. It happens once a month. Yeah, so? Right, so, you know, full moon. Yeah. What if, uh... Okay, no. Stop. I'm just saying, you know, maybe there's a slight chance it was a werewolf. No. They look like zombies. Are you out of your... Goddamn mine. Oh. Werewolves? Seriously? What the fuck? No, werewolves don't look what, like what, that. What, what's so funny? They're hairy I beasts. I said literally the exact same thing. Okay. Werewolves are hairier you, than you my ball set. I mean, like, that did not zombies, look like a werewolf. Aliens. Yeah, zombies. Time hopping I Dracula's. zombies. Anybody? No. Ryan, shut the fuck up. <laughs> you want answers? I am not telling Ryan to shut up. I like Ryan. Ryan, right? And I like Dylan. Yeah. You want answers? I've got answers. Interrupt me again. You're on your own. <laughs> Whatever. Would it really be so crazy? With all the shit that we've been seeing with Nick? With the thing on the roof? Okay, it would really start to explain a lot of stuff. Dylan. I'm just trying to keep an open mind, okay? This is like your ghost stories. How is this so different from your ghost those, stories? Those are, those are just campfire stories. Like, there has to be a rational explanation for everything, for all of this. Okay, you were not talking so rational when you separated my hand from the rest of my body. You told me to. And that was actually pretty it's rational. bite with which you're faced, cleave limb from torso with great haste. What is this, what? Jumanji? What are we rhyming name. for? See? She's got a whole poem about it. There's more to all this than you think. Let me see that eye. Just let me finish. What? Then you can Show me that eye! If you believe me or not, I want to be grossed care. out. But I think you should hear all of it. Fuck. I wanted to see it because I wanted to go, Ooh! But whatever. We know that she loses an eye. The next few weeks were long. And I'm pretty sure that the Max dies, I guess? Fed and let us take showers, but aside from that, we barely saw him. Max and I, we talked a lot. I mean, what else are you going to do in a jail cell? As much as we could cell? about what happened that night. It was like trading conspiracy theories. We talked about the cop, the camp, the accident, the woods, the thing in the basement. What happened to Max? We just kept going over it all again nope, I gotta and again, the and nothing no was making sense. All we knew is that we needed to get out. Of I'm back. I'm back. He's doing push-ups and dips and sitting. It's like the same thing on replay. North Kill Police Department, July 12th. AKA, they have been there for a minute. I can't take this anymore. It's not that bad. They're probably in the same crap at camp. No, I can't take being in here anymore. Oh. Yeah, well, that part's pretty tough. We've got to do something. We've got to get out of here. We need a, p a plan. We keep saying that, but it's been weeks, so, you know, let me know if you have one. That's really not very helpful, Max. You are forgetting something. What? Just the ETBT. Tiny detail that I may or may not be a fucking werewolf, you Laura. Just keep it down. So what? What can we do, really? We run off into the sunset only to be stopped when I turn into a nasty ass monster and kill you and eat you, and then I run off alone into the sunset with little bits of you stuck in my teeth? Okay, okay, stop. Just one problem at a time. Okay, hold on. Let me let me let this sink in real quick because I'm just like watching this in almost disbelief. So we're really going with the theory that these are werewolves, right? So when they said that they saw a full moon the night that they got attacked, that means they got attacked by a werewolf that was chained inside of the Hackett camp basement and he got bit. So now he is a werewolf. So the next few weeks, he was just him without a scratch on him. And you expect me to believe on the next full moon, Max is going to turn into a werewolf, right? 
So they are werewolves, even though they look nothing like werewolves. I'm just trying to be on top of this. They're actually werewolves. Right, that's we, crazy. We don't even know if so that's Max is a really werewolf. going on, and we won't until we get the hell out of here. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, it seems to me that we only have two real options. We can play nice and try to get this guy on our side. What, so he'll let us go? Or we try to catch him off guard and make our escape. We've got to escape. What if we get on his good side? Okay, so let's say we get on his good side. I don't like being reckless in these games. Brunch and mimosas every Sunday till he sees the error of his ways? Yeah, I was being rhetorical. The dude doesn't have a good side to get on. I mean, he don't even talk to us half the time. I don't know. I think we could crack him. Let's do it. Laura, I think he's just biding his time until he can figure out a way to get rid of us. Permanently. Escape is the only way. I think we should try it. I think we should try it. I think we should try. I mean, if he was gonna kill us, we'd be dead by now. So what's he waiting for? I think Look, he's waiting just, for the next full moon then. If this doesn't work, we try to escape. Deal? Yeah. Deal. Okay, so I think I really need to make the best choices here. Let's do this, so, everybody. All right, how are we supposed to get this guy to like us if he won't even talk to us? I don't know. I mean, he's got to have a weak spot, like something we can use. It's not like we don't have time to figure it out. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Let me take a sip of this. Because I need some energy. Energy to figure hey, this hey. man out. T-Money. T-Money. I call you T-Money. Money? Why? You can call me Officer Hackett. Hackett? Like as in Hackett's quarry? What's it to you? Just interested is all. Feel like we hardly know you. Well, let's keep it that way, okay? Oh, come on, Team Money. Lighten up, man. No reason we can't be buds, right? I can think of seven. List them. Understanding we've been awful. Skeptical, really? We've been You're awful. Right. I get it. We've been just awful, and we really want to make it up to you. I mean, if you put it like that, he can obviously see oh. right through you. Yeah, see, the sheriff is I see what you're doing. It. Yeah, see? Well, it's not going to work. You think we're just going to be besties, and I'm going to let you walk right out of here. Not going to happen. Asshole! Max! Damn! We know what's going on! We know Max is a werewolf! Ooh. Full moon's in a few days, right? What, what then? No, ma'am. You don't know the half of it. Hmm. Well, that was a bad choice to try to get on his good I side. I said... Take your fucking clothes off! Fuck off! Get back! Max, what's going on? Get the fuck away from him! I don't think escaping would have done anything. There would have been no way out. But yeah, Max looks rough. Come here. Get off of me! Shut up. Have a seat. Stop! Quit squirming. Said you want to be a vet, right? Call us an internship. Let me go! You're not gonna believe it until you see it for yourself. Just fucking ask next time then, dude. Jeez. Don't get too close. T, come in. What's your position? Over. Shit. That sounds like the Chris Hackett guy. Mm-hmm. Just wrapping things up here. Call for help? Nope, because he's in on it too. I can tell that that's the Chris Hackett voice. Down to 20. Over. What's gonna happen? Well, I'll tell you. It's not gonna be pretty. But don't worry, I'll be back at dawn. At dawn? You're really gonna leave me right, here? You'll be fine. I guess we'll be here until Just don't dawn? don't get too close. You know, you know what I mean? 
Ah, ça tarde. Ça me tarde. That is cool though that if they are werewolves, they will go back to normal after the full moon is down. So that means they're not dead dead. They're just werewolves, which is kind of badass. Like, what's not badass about becoming a werewolf? I thought they were zombies. Clinical, tell me what you're feeling. Compassionate, I'm here. I'm here. Don't worry, Max. I'm here. Yeah. Yeah, right. Are you all right? Uh, yeah. I don't know. I just don't feel so good. Um, what do you need? What can I do to help? Oh, it's just hot. Are you hot? Oh, I'm kind of stuck next to this big ass pipe, so I'm not exactly cool. Just stay back, okay? You shouldn't be this close. Well, we're There's separated by bars, so I'm Gucci. Right I'm kind of excited to see him transform. <laughs> Am I a sick fuck? Max? Max? What's going on? How she lost her eye? Holy fuck. She's a G. She's not even like screaming or anything. I don't like the music in this game. It's weird. Yeah, it doesn't fit at all. And yeah, people have been telling me to turn on streamer mode for this, but I guess there's like a bug where you turn on streamer mode, but it still plays copyright of music. That's why I got copyright claimed four times. <laughs> That's badass though. I didn't think that that's how she was gonna lose her eye. I thought she was gonna fight with the officer and the officer was like, gonna shoot her in the eye or stab her in the eye or something. So she walked back to her cell? I would've escaped right after that. Let's see what that bastard cop's hiding. Yeah, why did she sit back in her cell? Hold on. You still there? Oh shit! Whoa! Okay, I did not expect that. <laughs> that is so cool. Can I do it again? Let me do it one more time. What if we get closer? Okay. Sorry, Max. Sorry. I'm not trying to tease you. All right. I guess the cop just left. Let me see if I can find any more tarot cards because those are useful. Very useful, actually. Let's see. This looks like an abandoned police station. I don't think that this man is a cop at all. What am I doing? What was that about? Oh. Locked. Figures. And I guess I can't leave Max. Better keep snooping, or I could go back to my cell and wait, I guess. No, we're snooping. We're snooping so hard. I need to figure out what the hell this man knows. And where did he even go? He went to the guy that was on the radio, right? I think that was Chris Hackett. I'm gonna need to rest soon. All right, all right, all right, all right, calm down. Can't believe the guy scratched her eyes out. What the fuck? That was badass. A burnt badge? Whoever was wearing this cap be doing too well. Yeah, that man's barbecue chicken. Clue discovered. 
charred sheriff's badge. This old sheriff's badge is badly fire damaged. Does it belong to the current sheriff or one of his predecessors? I don't know, but man's well done. Uh, you kept that on the grill a little too long. Hmm. Can't look at these stacks of papers. Okay. Nothing over here. The woods are outside. I wish you woods type shit. That was the only clue that was in that big ass room? Come on, man. I'm not trying to get loud, but sheesh. Sheesh, sheesh, sheesh. I need a gun. I need a strap. Full moon on the 24th. Birthday beers. Oh, July can't miss the birthday beers. Why does she smile like that? Did that say undercover cop too? <laughs> Interesting. I bet you there's a tarot card back here. Fuck, maybe not. That's the needle that he put in my neck. This must be what he used to knock me out. I can hide this in my cell. Yes. All right. Is that it? Oh, shit. Oh, I thought that was somebody hiding in the corner. I need to lie down. No, 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 no. Not yet. Not yet. We still have a couple more things to investigate. Don't get tired yet. Come on, wake up. Splash some cold water on your face or something. We have a couple more things that we need to see. And if I can't find a tarot card, ooh, I'm going to be so pissed. I'm going to check down in the basement. Or... Fuck, stop howling. Can we go here? This is the exit, huh? Yeah, I don't think I'm going to be able to get out. Oh, yeah. This is his office. Sometimes it's hard to see because the camera's so close to the characters. Hello? That ghost need to stop hitting my line. Like, find your Silas and leave me alone. That was weird, though. <laughs> Imagine she's just waiting by the phone, waiting for someone to pick up. The fuck? T-hack it. Hint, so my much birthday. Not a slap in the face. Isn't it July 7? Birthday beers? Day and month, but no year. Come on, Laura. Really? Fuck. Okay. Four months on Hiker still missing. Ann Radcliffe and Edward Benson. Wonder who they are. So there's no date of birth, no nothing? Okay. Damn, I guess I gotta go find it. Can we go here? Nope. What's this? What's he hiding? I have to get onto the computer. Really, really bad. I'm gonna go down here. Wait. I have exhausted this and myself. I need to sleep. No, 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 no. I need to figure out the birthday. This is not fair. Wait, I've never been here. How have I never been here before? Huh. Mama's boy. 56, 56, huh? That means he was born in 1965. Old ass. He's way too old to be acting like a, that big of a bitch. 
Did I even make sense there? I said, he's a way too old uh, to be acting like that big of a bitch. What am I even talking about? I'm acting like a big bitch right now. But yeah, his old ass, that's the password to his computer. What a dumbass, dude. I guess he's not going to ever get into cybersecurity because that is so stupid. To have your birthday as the password? Come on, bro. That's something an old person would do, too. Like, that's something, like, my mom would do. Shout out to my mom, though. I know she watches the video sometimes. She's probably not even watching this, though. She, she don't like watching people that cuss. So she would never watch somebody like me. <laughs> but yeah, birthday boy, 56 years old, 1965. Got him. Fuck yeah. Even the computer's old. Hey T, you heard this shit? We gotta shut it down. Can you handle it for me, Chris? at all but ghost hunters who went in search Bizarre of yet bonafide podcast the mercy of the hag of another Hackett's clue quarry, never to be seen again like us except for the fell victim to the mercy of the blah 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 blah, blah part we're we're more like um ghost investigators specter sleuths sure so what happened next well according to reports from the local paper the north kill gazette some hay bales caught fire during the opening night and she's just chilling like the cop isn't gonna come back anytime soon was up in smoke including the show's leading lady and her alleged baby what's up with these facial expressions oh shit Oh my Oh I hate that screeching noise. That shit made my nipples flutter. It was like brrr. Okay, we gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. Back to your cell. I guess no tarot cards here. So wait, wait, wait. What is that? What are you hiding, Travis? Another evidence collected. Sweet. So it wasn't even just a clue, it was evidence. I'll be don'ts. Oh! Found it! Yeah! Good thing I walked through those desks. Fuck yeah. I would have been so upset if I didn't get it. Is that it for real? I think that's it for real, everybody. So we have the syringe. So next time he comes, it's a wrap. While the town of North Kill lay there sleeping, the hag in the woods started weeping. As the bodies decay, the wolves hunt their prey, and the sheriff continues his creeping. Scrawled Limerick, another clue. How many clues do we have? I wonder if the clues matter to the end of the story. Yeah, buddy. Good thing I did that. He probably would have searched me. Go to sleep or continue looking. No, it's time to go to sleep. I think we've done everything we need to do. And if I missed anything, damn. Because I did a thorough search. Like, I was really about that. You want to tell me what happened? Why is I your face all you bloody? The same thing. Why didn't you run? Honest, I won't leave Max. We've got unfinished business. I won't leave Max. I won't leave Max. That's my boy. This doesn't mean I trust you. I don't care. I just want to help him. Turn around, hands against the wall. The sheriff admires your dedication. Seriously? I am too tired to argue. But... Ugh. I told you Me he was going to search us. But we clutched it by putting the syringe behind that brick. Happy? A 
Brew some coffee. Hmm. He could literally kill us whenever he wants, but he's not going to. I wonder why. What's this? Okay, this makes a lot of sense now. Watch. I don't think that this cop's that bad at all. I really don't. Hmm. Nice job cleaning up. The eye. I mean. It's I'm second guessing if I want to use the books. syringe. Especially when nobody's helping you. You're the doctor. Uh, animal doctor. And no, I'm not. And I probably never will be stuck in here forever. Yeah, what is your end you know, goal, bro? Just because you know doesn't mean you know. You know? Yeah, I know. Uh, Do you know that I know that you know? What? I'm not. This isn't what it seems to be. You're gonna have to be more specific. He's literally holding them against their will, so... You and Max are in just as much trouble as I am. My family? We didn't mean to hurt anybody. We're just trying to survive like everybody else. Do you understand? Not really. We're going to end this thing once and for all. Okay. We? Yeah. Curious, how is your family involved? Yeah, I am curious. So, how is your family involved? My family... ...is down at the bottom of a well. The sheriff starts to ease up. What? Slowly trusting us. Family is the most important thing in the world. But if your whole family... ...you know, like... Every last one of them decided to jump down the bottom of a well, and they're all just... ...hanging on the end of a rope. How can one person be expected to pull them all back out? You can't. If you pull on that rope, and you're just gonna fall right down to the bottom of the well with the rest of them. And what's the point of that? Right, so you... You're the one at the top of the well with a rope, and... Yes. I thought that was obvious. <laughs> yeah, okay, yeah, I got it. <laughs> <Just forget. laughs> Bro, calm down. Calm down. I'm starting to think that it might be safer in here Let's for see them. how smart you really are. I'm really starting to think that. What is this? Information. Because at least we know with one of the werewolves oh, in Max, he, he can't escape the cell, so... Read it. If he can't escape it, then there's no way he can get to Laura. When full the moon above shines first, the beast internal shall outward burst. One by one leads lambs to slaughter. It stalks your breath, but shuns clear water. So it doesn't like water. And should you yourself be cursed... Armed with silver and the first. When moon is full before its wane. Rend the beast that cursed you slain. Rend the beast that cursed you slain. No longer oh. shall you face your blight or fear the dread of full moon's light. Yeah. Keep reading. Nope, I'm not gonna take the gun. I'm gonna keep reading. Cause I'm curious. 
I think there's some valuable information in that letter. And if it's a bite with which you're faced, cleave limb from torso with great haste. Perchance you'll save your cursed soul before infection takes its toll. That's what we did with Dylan. We cut his starting hand off. Starting to get the picture. Yeah. It's not a lot to go on. It's actually starting to make sense to me. And frankly, it's shit. Why did they have to make it rhyme? Sounds cooler. I don't know. But it's all we have to go on. Kill the werewolf that bit you and you'll be cured. It has to be silver. It has to be full moon. Okay, so we need silver to kill the werewolves. Just like Seems in pretty straightforward to me. A lot of tales about werewolves, if I think. If you can kill the werewolf, and that's a big F. I just want to cure Max. It's not as straightforward as you think. Confused. Why didn't you kill it? Am I infected? Yeah, why didn't you kill it? If you knew all this, why didn't you just that kill world it in is the probably a hack it then. when you had the huh. chance? It's not so... I'm, I, I was, when I, straightforward? No, yeah, it's so not... You... They're not so easy to hit. I was trying to protect you two. Were you? Well, you were. I don't believe you. So what's the plan? So what's the plan? Well, that's where I'm hoping you'll come in. <laughs> what? Me. Yeah. Because your studies. A veterinarian? I haven't even started. Well, you're the best option I got. I've been hunting this damn white wolf under the full moon so long I start to think it doesn't exist, you know? Maybe it doesn't matter because maybe there's another way. Whatever you believe, there's got to be some science. And you do science. Look, take some time to think about all this. I'll be back in the morning. What he's saying is making a lot of sense to me. Seen enough? What did he see? He really do look like he's seen some shit. Okay. So we need to kill the werewolf that got Max so we can cure Max. I don't think I'd believe a word he just said if I hadn't... That might be the that. same werewolf that bit Nick. Two birds, one stone, maybe. I believe him. I do. I believe him. You can't tell me you really trust that guy now. I didn't say that. I said I believe him about the werewolf stuff, not the science bit. I don't know what he wants. He's a dirty line kidnapping cop Max is lawyer. Dubious. We should be careful of anything that fucker says. Well, good for me. I don't know what dubious means. Well, fuck him. Yep. He's had his chance to fix this. We're getting out of here and we're going to fix it on our own. Hey, Laura. Yeah? I saw what happened. What I did to your eye? Yeah. Is it bad? Yeah, it's pretty bad. I'm so sorry. Empathetic. That wasn't you. It's not like you're in control. That wasn't you. Obviously, Max didn't mean to do that. It's something inside it of him that's you. taking control of it. I know it wasn't you. Can't blame him. But it was. But you didn't want to do it. Or did We're you? I'm gonna fix you, Max. You probably did, huh? You sicko. In that case, I take it back. I promise. I'm just kidding. We're gonna fix this. So I believe everything that the cop is telling us. And I really feel like everything that we need to know was in that rhyme. How'd you find out? Bob told me. Said you scrapped an abandoned car. A while back, I, I worked out the rest. Shit. 
Why? Well, why'd you think, Chris? Jesus, Travis. You're still here? That's fucked up. Fucking bit one of them, Chris. What's I supposed to do? <sighs> what was that? Oh, shit. Chris is the one that bit Max. And Chris is probably the one that bit Nick, too. So we probably have to kill Chris. Shit. You shot me. I'm telling mom. Take your lucky stars wasn't silver. I'm telling mom. What's your plan? You can't keep him here forever. Are you kidding me? Maybe if you'd done your job, they wouldn't have been at the camp that night. You ever think of that? If I'd have done my job, you'd all be in prison. You ever think of that? That was all Bobby and Caleb. Were those know. hikers and that, that, that fucking journal? Oh, damn it, Travis. What are we going to do now? Whatever happened to, we're all in this together. Shh, man. Let's go to my office. I shouldn't talk here. You think? We literally heard all the good shit. Max. Uh. Max. Uh. What so is Chris it? is the main werewolf, I guess. Travis was just in the hall talking, the cop. Or maybe uh, all the Hackets are werewolves Chris besides the Hackett. cop. Was he here to let us out? <laughs> is he no. here to let us out? He's the werewolf, Max. Chris Hackett is the one that bit you down on the storm shelter. So he locked himself down in the basement, Holy or at least shit, the other that's... Hackets did. Who would have guessed? What at the least? I mean, I guess, thinking about it, I could have... And yet you didn't. <laughs> what it the all hell makes is sense. The... That's why Chris's car was at the lodge that night. Travis was protecting him. That's why he followed us, and that's why he didn't kill the werewolf in the storm shelter because it was his fucking brother. God, it's so obvious. If, if Chris was the one that bit me, then got to shoot him in yeah, the freaking that's face. That's how we fix you. That's Jesus why Laura, Laura was looking for Chris thing? Hackett. She was gonna blast that fool. Yeah, she was gonna go doop 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 doop. Tomorrow we're getting out of here. Doop 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 doop. I'm gonna get Travis's gun and kill Chris Hackett. Yes, sir. Let's get it. She's a badass, bro. Hey, hey, help her. Laura needs help. All right, let's get out of here, everybody. We know what to do. Laura. Laura, are you okay? God damn it. <laughs> God damn it is right. You know what's about to happen. What the hell's going on? Laura! Get him, get him, get him. Wait, the cop doesn't see that? Oh, yeah! Kill shot! Fuck. <laughs> I'll take the gun, I'll take the keys, I'll take the car, I'll take everything. Go, Laura? Yes, I will take that. Hopefully it's not a full moon tonight. <laughs> Bro, he really does look like Chucky right now Sorry, with those suspenders. Really sick. Well, maybe I should consider acting as my major. I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> she did pretty good. We should go before he wakes yeah. up. <sighs> Tell me he don't look like a grown-up Chucky from Child's Play. Hi, I'm Chucky. Wanna play? That looks creepy. That looks freaky deaky. Go. We should grab our stuff. We need silver ammo. He must have some around here. It's got to be in that one room that was locked. <sighs> what is it? Shit. Paranoid. I thought I heard someone. Someone thinks he... No, I, I still can't. It's coming from behind that door. Is the Hag of Hackett's quarry a Hackett too? They did this to us. So that means the Hackett's killed Silas probably? 
I'm trying to think. So at least we know we have to kill Chris. We do have an objective, a clear one. There's nobody in here. What the fuck? It's the Hag of Haggard's Quarry! He makes them. What is it? Silver ammo? Shotgun shells. Oh. He loads them with silver. That's where he was last month, hunting. Well, I guess I won't be needing this anymore. Hey, I just realized something. We're free. <laughs> Not until Chris is dead. Hell yeah, we are. Yeah. Not no, until he's dead. Max. We're not free until Chris Hackett is dead. And it doesn't look like we've got much time. I know, you're right, but let's just take the win for now, huh? We'll celebrate when it's over. Exactly. We're going straight you don't to the celebrate quarry, in the middle. And we're ending this. Celebrate at the tonight. end. Anybody knows that. That's cool that there's silver ammo in the shotgun shells. That's sick. So I wonder in the present day where Max is right now. Did he try to like hide himself? Kind of like what Chris did inside of the basement at Hackett's Quarry. Did Max do that because he knew there was going to be a full moon? Or did something happen to Max? And I made my way here to camp. Left Max at the island. Seemed okay. Like the best place for him, surrounded by water and all. That's good. And then he swam here. <laughs> That's it. That's the story. He's like swimming there in werewolf and I'll form. Jump in at the same time. Wait. In the island? Like like our island, like the one in the lake? Yeah, why? Oh shit. Cause Jacob he went back there looking for Emma and he hasn't come back yet. Not at the man. Oh has. my god. Oh shit. So that werewolf is Max. They're not there now. They're probably fine. They're not there now. How do you know? Well, if they were there, they're not there now. What's that supposed to mean? Don't make me spell it out for you. I've just come back from there and there's one werewolf and no people. Oh, fuck. No, they're both alive. All I know is I, can I tell have you to that. do this. I got skills that pay the bills. I have to kill Chris Hackett before it's too late. After you saw me at the pool, after I shot Chris, um, I went back to the island expecting Max to be back to normal, but he's still a beast. He's still a hideous beast. This game is pretty badass. It's kind of weird at times. But the werewolf thing, aside from how they look, it is cool. I like it. And the Hag of Hackett's core is actually kind of creepy. So that's what it was. She Max? kept Max inside of the trap door at the top. Emma let him out. That's why he's just running around all naked. Yeah, he was supposed to be Max. in that cabin, but Emma's dumbass opened it. Max? Hello? Shit. Great! Well, the good thing about this is that we know she's not going to die. Right?
Oh yeah, they can't go in the water because they can't swim. That's why what I said about him swimming there doesn't even make sense. <laughs> Okay, yoga poses. I see you. Doing an upward dog. My bad, G. Hackett's so Corey can't I pull killed helps. can't have been Chris. That wasn't a werewolf. It was Haley Hackett, Chris's daughter. Whatever I shot, that was no girl. Unless, I, I guess, it turned back after I shot it when I went to the island. Wait. Hold on, everybody. I need to go pee-pee real quick. Okay, I'm back. Where so... were we? How come Max didn't kill you? Show bite, hide bite. Oh crap! I didn't even know she got bit. Okay, show the bite. He tried. I got away. I need to end this. So she's potentially gonna turn into a werewolf. No, come on! Fuck. We don't have much time. Okay, that was bad. But I feel like being honest with them is the only way we're gonna stop this. Who the fuck is that? Is that the Hag of Hackett's quarry? She looked like it. Who the hell is this? Smell good, don't it? Go on, take a bow. Come on. Oh. Dumb fucking animal. Wow, hey. Watch out with that attitude, lady. Yeah, those don't look like traditional werewolves, but I guess I have to get used to it. The werewolves in this world are all go. bald and Let me fucking go. Get your hands muscular, off. I guess. <laughs> Pleading, please let me go. Threatening, I'll call the cops. They don't give a shit. <clears throat> Please let me go. Okay. I didn't mean for this to happen. Please. Please. Oh my God. Why aren't you answering me? Oh, oh, oh. Is your, is your money that you want? Because cause my dad's got money. Like lots of it. I mean, I mean, not really, but you could get some. Probably. Please. Just let me go. Please. I'm so sorry. So sorry. You didn't even do anything. <laughs> oh, Jesus <geez>, Christ. <laughs> He was like, oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Don't tell me we're in the same cage as that beast. No, 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 no way, no way, no way. That's too, Bobby. Why are they keeping us here, though? Hey! Hey! Hey, where are you going? Hey! Hey! I hear that werewolf. Oh shit. Oh shit. Who is that? Wait, that's Nick, huh? That's gotta be Nick. Cause Max is running around. Chris is probably looking like a leader werewolf. That's gotta be Nick. Okay, that's gotta be him. Yeah, um, there's not that many werewolves. I think there's only like three. Nosy little rat, aren't you? Me? Poking your nose where it doesn't belong. Don't believe everything you hear. You look like a rat. Anyway, here we are again. Let's see what you've brought me this time, shall we? I brought you one. It's a good one too, the chariot. What you know about that? The chariot. At the reins of a chariot, we would all feel safer. Taking control, relying on determination to make our choices. Valiant. But in some cases, foolish. Many seek refuge in chariots. But perhaps in some cases, they're not as safe as we think they are. And the same question as always. Will you let me show you more? Absolutely, ma'am. Show me more, please. 
All right, let's analyze this, everybody. Dylan? He's opening a door. You'll be seeing That's me it. a few more times before the night's over. I look forward to that, as long as you follow the right path, of course. Okay. So, this episode is going to be a little bit shorter than the other ones. I'm sorry about that, everybody. I'm going to make the next episode longer than any episode that I've uploaded of the quarry so far. I promise you all that. The Hackett's Quarry Camp Pool House. Crap! I kind of want to see this part. Where is Chris Hackett? <laughs> Shut up. Wow. Let's see this part. Let's see Gosh, this part. she murdered Kaylee. We have been over this. Commanding, I said, shut up, Caitlin. What do I do? Uh, Caitlin, what do I do? Oh, wow, real strong showing on the leadership front. Laura said, doesn't respect up. you. Wow, uh, no way. I am really? not getting involved. This is all you, buddy. Just think about everything that's happened tonight, okay? That's all I'll say. Unconvinced. All this over a poem? You said you heard a woman. Hold up. You you said you heard a woman crying when you escaped? Why? What do you know? It's the ghost story he told us about, right, Caitlin? This isn't a ghost story. It's a creature feature. It's really happening, and you're all in it. Your bracelet. What about it? What are you doing? I'll shoot you. Yeah, what are you doing? What are you doing? I'm trying to help. Worst case scenario, this should give you a fighting chance. And this will kill them? For good? Yeah. But what if it's Nick or someone? Like I said, worst case scenario. Okay. Brian, put that fucking thing down before you hurt someone. So, come on. Where does Chris Hackett live when he's not at camp, I mean? How the hell should we know? What makes you think I know? I wouldn't tell you. I wouldn't tell you? Well, she just told us the whole story about why she needs to find Chris Hackett. What makes you think what I know? What makes you think I know that? Uh, you guys are counselors, right? You've spent the last two months here? He's not in the storm shelter. I'm clearly getting nowhere hunting him in the woods. I need a place to start. I think that spooky house behind these woods. Of course. Dude. What? Have you thought about not killing him? Maybe there's another way. Listen, there's always there could be two sides. Way. Have you thought about that? I've spent the last month thinking about nothing else. Look, when the sun comes up, I am stuck until the next full moon. So is Max, so is anyone else he's bitten. How is that our problem? Why don't you ask your friends in the woods? Don't forget about Nick, dude. Yeah, he's still alive, technically. Okay, any clothes are going to spray you two with cold water. Ryan, let's just get out of here. I'm running out of time. If I can't find Chris Hackett, then a lot more people are going to get hurt. I'm going with you. What? what? Uh, yeah, what they said. Friendly, Chris has nothing to do with this. No way you're going alone. There's no way I'm letting a murdering fugitive like you go anywhere near Chris on I didn't own. know he was going to say that. Are you flirting with me? What? No. Fine, do whatever you want. You saw what happened to Nick. He was bitten. Everything's gonna be fine. That cop car you stole, where is it? Ditched in the lake. Why? It was a stolen cop car. You're gonna have to try and fix the minivan. Get somewhere safe. How long do you have? An hour or two? I don't know. It doesn't seem like an exact science. 
then we better get going. Okay, so I'm definitely going to end it here. So in the next episode, we're going to be playing as Ryan and Laura. We're trying to find Chris Hackett. If you want to see that as soon as possible, make sure you give this video one big fat like. And tell a friend today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is that dude!